everybody, welcome back. Big Smith has been making music in the Ozarks for 25 years. There's an anniversary celebration coming up this weekend. I want you to say hello to Mark Ballou and Jay Williamson of Big Smith and Mark Schween, owner of The Riff. Hi guys. Hello. hello. I am so delighted to hear about this show. How did Big Smith get started? We started in downtown Springfield, mm -hmm. a place called The Bar Next Door. Right. Uh, and we built the band one person at a time. I was playing and then my cousin Mike joined in and then we got my cousin Jay and then we got my brother Jody, we're all cousins. Right. And just one by one and we sort of learned how to do what we were doing on the stage there at the bar next door. That's very good. It, so it's, it definitely is a family affair. Still? Yeah, always has oh, yeah. been. Yep. Always has been, yep. still is. And then there's Rick, that's the fifth one. We're all first cousins, we all share a set of grandparents. Very cool. How'd yeah. you get the name Big Smith? Well, um, I've always wondered about that, and I've never known the answer to that. How did well, that come we about? took it from the overalls company, Big Smith Overalls. I yeah. wondered. That's okay. what our grandfathers and uncles wore. Uh, and eventually, after a few years, we decided to ask the company, is it okay that we're doing this? <laughs> and they loved it, and they sent us free overalls. And yeah, so. Well, hence we the outfit permission. that many of you don the overalls. So, okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. Makes, makes total sense to me now. Yep. Um, so it's been a lot of years. How many albums? We've done seven okay. uh, releases. A couple of them were double CDs, some studio recordings, some live, some uh -huh. gospel, some children's. Um, yeah, over the years. You guys do a little bit of everything, and it's so much fun to listen to. I think we have a little bit of video of them performing, and you have performed for a very, very long time now. Mark, how are things at the Riff? Good? Things are going really well. Had a great weekend with some opening tribute shows we did last weekend. It was a lot of fun, a lot of energy. It sounded like it was going to be a lot of energy. I, um, I'm eager to get back over there. It's one of my favorites. How big of a deal is this one for you coming up this weekend? It's huge. When they reached out, I was so excited because I've been a fan ever since I've been here. Oh, I've been yeah. in Springfield since 83. I've seen them probably seven or eight times myself. And just out of the blue, we kind of connected. and. Uh, just all the stars aligned for everything to work out because we can hold. It's it's going to be close to. If it's not sold out, it'll be real close. Oh, I I, I would venture to guess it would be. Now there are two nights of shows, correct? Friday and Saturday. Mm -hmm. So what are you guys going to do for the big anniversary? What have you got planned? Anything exciting? Anything unusual? We're going to play all the hits, George. Every one you <laughs> ever recorded. All the hits. Uh, all the hits. All the hits. Okay. We used to uh, do shows a lot of, for a long stretch. There we had a little slideshow that we liked to run behind with pictures of us and family members and way back, just all kind of the stuff that yeah. inspired and whatever. So we're going to try and pull it back out. And that's always a fun thing for the audience members to see as we're playing. And Well, it is because every one of us can relate because we'll look at those and I remember mm -hmm. that. But then there's things about your family that we don't typically see either. Mm -hmm. So that gives us a peek behind the curtain. Mm -hmm. can, can we accommodate that, do you think, the slideshow? I think we that? can probably. Okay. Yeah. Very good. It's going to be a lot of fun for sure. Um, do you guys, um, I mean, have you got new music coming up or what are you working on now? We're going to be playing all the hits, Joy, all the hits. All the hits. Now, <laughs> Any new hits, though? You've got, you've got some, I'm sure, they are just on the cusp of being a huge hit, we, right? Well, since the, we kind of parted ways in 2012. Oh, okay. Reunited in 2016. Right. Since then, we've been playing a handful of shows a year, you know. Okay, right. So we don't, like, have any new uh, albums in the works or anything like that because we're all doing separate things now, but but we still love getting together and, you know, getting to spend time with each other and play music and, and stuff, so. So you're saying there's a shot. There may be <laughs> new music That's on the horizon, right? That's, what I, That's what I think that I heard. It, it's, anything is possible. Well, if you have anything new, you're welcome to play it this weekend, I'm sure. Uh, Friday night, Saturday night, what time? 6.30 or door is 7.30 show. We've got a couple pre-acts, uh, one each night. And these guys will be on stage till I believe, about 11.30, 11, 11.30. Until they run you out? We're going to play a, a, a long, lot of music. a healthy show, a long, a long show. A healthy show. Yeah. How long many are in the band again? There's five of us. Oh man, it's going to be great. And thank you for what you do because you've raised the spirits of us in the Ozarks for all these years. Well, a quarter century. That kind of yeah. freaks me out. Does thank that kind of freak you out? A little bit. Yeah, yeah me too. Yeah. I know. All right, this weekend at the Riff, there's great food and drink there. It's a wonderful, wonderful venue if you haven't been there in a while. Mark Ballou, Jay Williamson, Mark Schween, thank you all for coming in. Thank, thank you. Joy. All right, check them out this weekend. Now it is time, however, to check